The next pattern in the Moving Features Between Objects series is the opposite of Hide Delegate, and it's called Remove Middleman. Now, you may have noticed in the previous example, we also had this charge code, and so here we've created a delegate for the charge code as well. And now suppose this department object has a lot more properties on it, and we have to keep creating all these delegates here. We have to keep creating all these additional properties where all they do is act as a middleman to pass through to the department object. Well, at that point, violations of law of Demeter aside, what we're essentially getting are some diminishing returns. We're sacrificing the bottom line of supportability just for the purpose of having to only use one dot when we're trying to get at a property for an employee's department. And so we can reverse that. In the efforts of trying to make our code more supportable and more simple, if we ended up with dozens of these methods here, or dozens of these properties rather, which do nothing but delegate to that private property, well, we can make that a lot simpler by just exposing that private property again. So let's say we have our calling code again. And we have our employee. We want to get that employee's manager. Now, we want to remove this middleman, or two of them in this case. And so, what we're going to do is first make this public. And then we can just get rid of this manager property directly. In a more complex system, we might make it private and have it have something else delegate to it depending on what that functionality is doing. But for something as simple as this, we can just get rid of it. And the compiler tells us that we can't use that property anymore. So we go through the department and get the property there. And then we would do the same thing with charge code. We've already made the department public, and so we can just remove charge code. And any code that uses it, the compiler will tell us that we have to update that code now. Essentially, all we did was reverse the efforts from the previous pattern. And as usual with a lot of these patterns, there are pros and cons either way. And so a lot of these patterns come in pairs of opposites, where sometimes it makes sense to use one pattern, and sometimes it makes more sense to use another. There's no one-size-fits-all. It's a matter of what works for this particular code. That's it for the remove middleman pattern. Thanks for watching.